Well, Miami is becoming a real city. It's the place where you really want to live. This building is at one of the most important corners, the entrance to the city in South Miami Avenue. The building is steps away from Brico City Center, which is the latest luxury mall being built in Miami. It's the largest project in the United States. It'll be the Rockefeller Center of Miami and of the South. SLS Lux, it's going to be quite unique in the sense that it's going to contain world art that none of our other projects have. A sculpture that has been exhibited in Champs-Élysées and in different parts of the world. Light sculptures are an art of our times where people have mastered the electronic era to create works of art that are kinetic. This creates movement as this uh, light design rises up the building. So that you will see this gigantic piece of art from very far away. The whole facade of the building is conceived a complete art installation. It's going to be very recognizable just because of the art it's going to have. It is a, a monumental piece of art, it's urban art. Its form is very organic, it's very soft. It's not a hard urban building. It has curved corners, so it has an undulation that gives it a very sensuous shape that is uncommon in a dense urban setting. You have great expectations when you see a building like this from outside. Those expectations have to be fulfilled also when you're inside. And I think that including Yabu Pusherberg for the interiors, I think it's complementary to the objective of creating a special architecture for this building. Interior designers that have worked with us for a number of years on a number of projects, the St. Regis Hotel, the W Hotel, our own Apogee in South Beach, Marea, and One Ocean. You know, this project is now the kind of another step up where where we're related is creating their own hotel brand, where where they're tie, they're weaving into a yeah, into a residential space for them, and it's in the heart of the city. It's it has a huge art component to it, a huge cultural component to it, and we're making this Latin vibe in it. And I think all of those things get us really excited about. It. Another special feature of the project is that all the units will have private elevators. The floors are going to be done with packages designed specifically by Yabu Pusherberg, the same as the kitchens and the luxurious bathrooms that the whole project will have. This building, in short, will have all the amenities that the new modern urban dweller of Brickell wants, from getting five-star dinners delivered to your unit from Katsuya Restaurant or the S-Bar and the ground floor to personalize tennis lessons at your tennis court in the pool deck of SLS Lux. We have a long pool, a tennis court, like the country club in the middle of the city. Next to the pool and the tennis court, you will find a state-of-the-art fitness center, a complete spa, and a Turkish hammam, the kids' room, and an appointed and fully serviced party room for the residents' exclusive use. There's another club on the 44th floor that overlooks the skyline of the city. And on the 57th floor, we have another deck with another pool that is sort of swimming in the sky on top of everything around you. SLS will pick you up and take you to your own beach club in South Beach. Just across the street, you can use the services of Equinox or Soul Cycle. So it's an ideal building for families and for people who really want to have the best amenities and the best art in the center of Ripple. I think this building represents the new era of urban living in Miami. We think that this project has the best of everything with the touch and refinement of the art that Related is known for.